Hello friends, I welcome you all to my channel and thank you all for subscribing my channel. Today I have taken a very simple but basic question how to find square root if it is in this form that means 29 minus 12 times of 105 you have to find the square root. So we will find square root of 29 minus 12 times square root 5. So let us recall the square form that is if it is a plus b whole square then it will be square of a plus square of b plus 2 times of a multiplies b. And if it is a minus b whole square then it will be minus b square is again positive and here we get a negative. It will be a square plus b square minus twice a b. Now for any number a and b, a square is always greater than equal to 0 and it is an integer. Similarly, b square, this is greater than 0, it is an integer or a positive integer. Similarly, square of a, a and b, it would be also an integer. So now, here there is an integer part and one is a rational part. So we will compare that a square plus b square must be 29 and 2 ab terms must be 12 under root 5. It may be positive, it may be negative. So let us take now let 29 minus 12 under root 5 square root is equal to a minus b. That means a minus b whole square is equal to a square plus b square minus twice a b. So now the comparison part a square plus b square minus twice a b. We can write a plus b whole square also, no problem because accordingly we will take the sign. So this will be 29 minus 12 root 5 under root 5. Or now we will compare the integer part is equal to 29 and minus twice a b is equal to minus. 12 under root 5 or twice AB is equal to 12 under root 5. Now you can think of product of two terms is your 6 root 5. You can find all options and you can by trial method you can find where a square plus b square is equal to 29. This is one way of doing finding A and B. I am uh, applying a formula that is, I am writing a square minus b square whole square is equal to a square plus b square whole square minus 4 times of a square b square. Or this is same as a square plus b, b square whole square minus twice a b whole square. This formula is nothing but your x minus y square is equal to x plus y whole square minus 4 times x y. This is a familiar formula. I am applying the same formula. Only x is a square and y is b square. So here getting a square minus b square square is equal to a plus b square is equal to your 29. So 29 square minus 4 times of ab square is 2ab whole square, 2ab is equal to 12 root 5 square. So 29 square means 841 and if we we'll take this square 12 times 12 is equal to 144 and root 5 under root 5 is 5. So this gives us 720. So this is nothing but your 121. 
So a square minus b square is equal to 1 square root of 121. This is your 11. Since I've taken a is greater than b, I've assumed that I'm not taking any negative 11, I'm taking as positive 11. Now I'm getting two relation a square plus b square is equal to 29 and now I got a square minus b square is equal to 11. Adding this 2, I'll get twice a square is equal to 40 and a square is equal to 20 or a is equal to plus minus 2 under root 5. So I got a. Similarly, if we put in any of this equation, substitute in in a square plus b square is equal to 29. This will be 20 plus b square is equal to 29. b square is equal to 9. Or b is equal to plus minus 3. So what is the answer now? There are four options because a is plus minus 2 root 5. So it can be plus, it can be minus. Similarly, b can be positive, b can be negative. But you have to consider this, this one twice a b is equal to how much? Negative. So either of them is negative. Since it is in the form 29 minus 12 root 5, that means either the of them is negative. B is negative. Or B. So it will be five minus three whole square. Equal to 29 minus 12 under root 5 or square root of 29 minus 12 root 5 is equal to 25 minus 3 or it will be negative 2 root 5 plus 3. So these are the two answers. One is 2 under root 5 minus 3 and minus 2 root 5 plus 3. So this is the 2 or square root of 29 minus 12 root 5. Let us check the answer. A square plus B square is equal to 9 plus 20, 29. So 9 plus 20, 12 root 5. Here its square is also 9 plus 20 minus 12 root 5. I hope you have enjoyed. We may take a square minus b square as negative 12 also. That time we will get b square is equal to 40 and a square is equal to your 9. So ultimately we get the same result. Thank you for watching the video and subscribing my channel. Keep on watching.